Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for August 25th of 2023. Well, it is titled A Season of Saturn. So what do we see here? Well, here we see six images of Saturn taken over the course of six years. So it's one each year from 2018 in the upper left hand side down to 2023 in the lower right hand side. And one thing that you'll notice is that there are some changes in, in Saturn's rings, especially in the orientation. Now the patterns within the ring seem pretty much the same. You have a brighter inner ring and then a gap and a fainter outer ring. And there's actually more rings to it than that. And in fact, Saturn has a several different rings beyond what we see here. Some are fainter and harder to photograph uh, from, from here from Earth. Now within the rings, we can start to see some detail. And if we could look at them even closer, we'd see that there's a lot of detail within the rings, that there are many ringlets within them. So they're not just sheets of material, they're actually multiple individual rings, which consist of billions of particles that are each orbiting around Saturn. Now the tilt occurs because of the tilt of Saturn as it orbits the sun. So the same way our Earth sometimes tilts toward the sun, and therefore we get summer when our hemisphere is tilted toward the sun, we get winter when it's tilted away, well, looking at Saturn, sometimes Saturn is tilted toward Earth and Sun, and we get a nice view of the rings looking down on them, as we see in the upper left. And as we can see, as we go down towards the lower right, the tilt has actually not changed, just our orientation around of seeing Saturn has changed. So we now see it very close to edge on, and will be even closer to edge on this next coming year. So the rings will go through this pattern with each season of Saturn as they'll go from uh, one edge fend one face we see down for the end of the season they'll be very very narrow then we'll see the opposite edge in this case we'd see the bottom of the rings over the next few years and then would go back to the edge again so we can see that continually as that changes over the course of the uh, of several years. Now on Saturn itself, we can see the banding and the ring structure that is present. And those are various different cloud layers within the planet's atmosphere. Saturn, like the other large planets, does not have a solid surface. So there is no place on Saturn to land. All we see is the atmosphere. So but we can see the different banding structures and in some cases, including in the upper left image near the pole, we see a storm. The white cloudiness is actually a storm on Saturn. So we see that in the upper image and we note that a year later the storm was gone. So some stores, storms can be very short lived such as this one. Other storms such as the great red spot on Jupiter can be much more long lived. So here we get to see a number of different images showing us how the orientation of the plane of Saturn's rings relative to Earth changes over in this case a period of six years. So that was our picture of the day for August 25th of 2023. It was titled A Season of Saturn. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Crescents of Venus. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.